Hello and welcome. Let's take a look at the top story we're tracking for you. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky has said he is counting on India, which now holds the G20 presidency, to push for the implementation of a Russia-Ukraine peace formula. Prime Minister Modi and President Zelensky spoke over the phone on Monday. In the fourth phone conversation this year, Zelensky congratulated Modi on the presidency of the G20, saying it had a key role to play in implementing peace between Russia and Ukraine. Сьогодні говорив з прем'єр-міністром Індії. В наступному році саме Індія головуватиме у великій двадцятці. Побажав пану Моді плідного головування, причому плідного не для когось окремо, а для усіх у світі, хто цінує мир. In a tweet after the phone call, Zelensky recounted the announcement of his peace formula at the G20 summit in Bali in November to end the war. He said he now counted on India's participation in its implementation as the G20 chair in 2023. The Zelensky Modi conversation is significant as India begins a series of meetings to finalize the agenda for the summit that is expected in September of 2023. Prime Minister Modi conveyed India's support for peace efforts while reiterating a call for immediate cessation of hostilities. Zelensky's 10-point peace plan had included ensuring radiation and nuclear safety, food and energy security, the release of prisoners and deported persons, and the implementation of the UN Charter with restoration of Ukraine's territorial integrity. Kiev has said it wants a UN-backed peace summit in early 2023 to end the war. However, it specifies that Russia must face a war crime tribunal first. The Modi Zelensky phone call comes in the backdrop of a meeting of the CIS nations and a huge support from Belarus for Russia's military operations in Ukraine. This includes the nuclear capable Iskander missiles. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.